In this screencast, we're going to set the visibility of an HTML element. With this CSS style rule, you can set an element to be visible and invisible. This CSS rule is similar to the CSS display rule with one very big difference. When you set the visibility using display none or display block, that element does not hold a place on the web page. But if you use the visibility setting, the element actually holds a place on the web page even when it's invisible. Now let me demonstrate. Let's open up our CSS folder. I have a visibility.html and then I just have an image. Let's first load this image in our browser. You see I have a block of text. I made it background red maroon actually and I have another block of text right after this image with the background color gray I just want to color code the blocks so you see how this image shows up when it's set to invisible now let's minimize this let's open this page up in top style you see that I have paragraph that has an inline style of background color maroon second block of text is right here with background color gray this is the image now I have two classes visibility and display let's first assign let's do it this way easier class equals visibility save it now it's visible let's bring back Firefox refresh great it's there now let's change this using our style selector to hidden save it bring back Firefox refresh so it's hidden right now but it holds a place of the image within the page now let's change it to display bring back Firefox now it's display block let's change this to none save it bring back Firefox watch if I refresh, the image is actually gone from the web page. It doesn't show up. It doesn't exist, actually. So this is the big difference. And uh, there are times when you need to use visibility, and there are times when you should use display none. And it's up to you as a web developer or a web designer. And that's it for this screencast. Thank you.